In this video, we're going to talk about draw latches. Draw latches are pieces of hardware that are used to join two components together, um, usually not permanently. They uh, allow you a convenient way to bring two pieces together and hold them there firmly, uh, but also allow you the ability to quickly and easily decouple those two parts so that they can be moved away from one another. This page on McMaster shows a variety of different draw latch configurations, uh, but they all do more or less the same thing. Let's see if we can zoom in on one a little bit. So we have the latch itself, which is what is shown on the left side, and then we have a, a, a little tab where it's called the keeper on the right side. And that keeper is mounted to one of your parts, and the, the draw latch is mounted to your other part. And so when you uh, hook the latch around the keeper, and engage the lever of the latch, it draws those two parts together. So let's look at uh, an example of how this is used in the real world. This is a box that we designed that needed to have a removable top. So this um, kind of uh, cyan colored top over here uh, can be removed and you can see a draw latch on either side, one here and another one here on the other side. Uh, and so this lever right here rotates up and that uh, uh, allows for the latch to, to move up and uh, release from the keeper. And this keeper, uh, in this case, the keeper is kind of uh, like a, a pin, uh, but it could also be more of a, a tab shape like we saw on the McMaster car website. And uh, once the, the levers are released and the latch uh, moves up and provides space to unlatch it from the keeper, then your, your mating component can be released and, and lifted off. Um, so in, in this case, uh, you know, these, these parts right here, these, these parts, this entire top, including the handle here, this all gets lifted up off of the, the black box once the draw latches are disengaged. Here's an example of how that entire top subassembly can lift off and away from the, um, uh, the rest of the box. And it looks like I incorrectly had highlighted this part down here that actually stays with the box. But regardless, um, the, the principle is not affected. And uh, these, these draw latches in combination with the, the keepers here are what allow you to quickly and easily um, uh, join or separate this top assembly from the rest of the box. This video here shows a nice animation of how a draw latch works. Uh, there are some uh, some things in this animation that I'll point out that are not always the case, but uh, fundamentally this is how a draw latch works. So the latch moves over, engages the keeper, you pull the lever down, and it brings the two parts together. Now I'll pause it here. Some One thing I'll state is um, sometimes your your two parts are already right next to each other and you're not trying to necessarily pull them close to one another and in that style you use a draw latch that that is more like what we saw in the CAD model where the the latch itself is, is, is kind of like a, a slightly curved shape and that curved shape bends it flexes a little bit so when you draw your latch down or your, your lever down, um, the, the curved latch actually bends a little bit. It deflects and it allows you to, uh, to, to put some tension in that, that, uh, that closed you know, interface between the two parts. So uh, you can start with two parts that are already touching. You don't necessarily need to draw one part into the other. Um, and I just wanted to point that out. So here's, here's another thing in this video. Uh, this particular draw latch has a spring inside of it. Not all draw latches have springs. This is just one example. So that, that's the basics anyway of how a draw latch works. This company, Southco, uh, makes a lot of cool pieces of hardware. One of them that they do really well 
is draw latches. They have a, a whole category here for draw latches. And we have used South Co many times in the past. They make a good product. Um, and you can see here they have uh, quite a few different types of, of draw latches. Um, and uh, you, can, you can dive down into the details here and take a look at all the different features and configurations they have. Uh, here's just one quick example of one of their specification sheets for a draw latch. They provide all of the dimensions and they, they give you an unstressed uh, unlatched length and, and they also tell you what the, the latch length can be. Um, it gives you hole patterns for mounting the draw latch. You have to mount your draw latch and your keeper to your two components and so these hole pattern dimensions provide you with a, a template of where those holes should be and how big the holes sh uh, should be sized. Um, and I believe you can download CAD models from Southco as well. Um, but uh, McMaster Car is also uh, a great place to get more or less the same thing. In fact, I imagine some of their draw latches are Southco draw latches. Uh, McMaster is probably a little bit more convenient to download things and to uh, check out different options. But um, Southco might have more options. I don't know for sure. Anyway, th those are a few places that you can check out draw latches. If you found this content helpful, consider enrolling in our signature program at mypipelineacademy.com. Whether you're an individual interested in beginning a new career as a mechanical designer or a company interested in training your new engineering hires, our signature program helps students develop the practical skills they need to be productive mechanical design engineers. Seating is limited. We hope to see you there soon.